There are several different views that you have in the bin view, so let's look into that. I'm going to increase the size of this project workspace by highlighting this area and then pressing tilde. Now you can see how I'm in list view right now. So when I click a disclosure triangle, I can come down and look at all the material that's in my bins. There's also an icon view. So if I click this icon right here, it gives me the icon view, which allows me to look at these by double clicking, opening them. And then I can always go back up one level by clicking this right here. In graphics, there's all kinds of material interviews, footage, etc. I can also change the size of any of these by moving the size slider. One more view that's available here is changing this header material. If you right click and go to metadata display, then you can see that everything is checked is actually what corresponds to what you see up here. So if you don't want to see any of these, or very few, and you just want to have a label and a media type and a frame rate, to just uncheck everything, click OK, and now you only see what you selected. So let's go back and add a few back in here. And now you have different views within your bins. And finally, if you click here and click Preview Area, it gives you a small preview of the particular file that you're looking at. So that's the various views that you can work with inside of your bins.